We'll get the start up front. It's Cameron Hobby Bula, last week's MLS Next Pro Player of the Week with the hat trick that he had. Six. He'll be the 20 year old, reps the Dominican Republic, four saves on the year. Isaiah Reed up on your left side there. He scored last season the four to one win. Sporting KC in their blues. Meanwhile, Dynamo Dose in the all orange with the black numbers as we are underway. Great matchup between these two sides. Both coaches, high praise for one another. Kenny Bundy talking about what his team needs to do coming into today's game. They really need to finish this ball. Played inside. Here's Javi Bula. Javi Bula coming over from Vancouver Whitecaps as he takes a rip and hits it off the post. A follow up opportunity possibly here for Sporting KC and going down too easily there was Hadigan. Great chance, good give and go action. Javi Bula with a great strike there, just a touch. Looking for his fourth goal in two games, nearly had it. Pierre strides up. And first foul of the game and first dangerous opportunity coming for Sporting KC. Javi Bula drives it, but right at Xavier Valdez. Always talked about how Kenny Bundy's team comes out, they're ready to play, give energy and effort. And Dynamo Dos now looking to respond here. A shot, and that's gonna be tipped and gone wide. Good job there by Sheaway. High praise from head coach Benny Failhaber about Javi Bula coming over from Vancouver. Says they don't have a player like him. Here on the overlap. Near post ball, tapped in for the opening goal of the game for Sporting Kansas City. And it's Balloon Kumbale getting the goal and putting the home side up on top in the ninth minute. Second goal of the season for Kumbale and just a simple tap on that near post. Nothing bad. Diagonal ball. Whistle there, so this will end up being a throw here for Sporting KC. Pierre, who had the assist. Pierre, once again, going towards the end line. Near post ball once again to Gumbale, this time sending it wide. Start right now for Dynamo Doses. They're really just having trouble. The service. Headed away. Flicked back by Silla. Had again. Sends it in with the left foot. Nice ball in there by Had again, but couldn't connect. Javi Bula drops it off. Clark with a long range shot, takes deflection, smothered up by Valdez. Gonzalez out wide. Ball whipped in, good pace behind that. So the Mark Herman Trophy winner out of Clemson last year in NCAA. A chance here, Reigns, blocked aside, and Rindov able to send the shot away after blocking it. Rodriguez at midfield. Four minutes this year, really leaning on him more to try to get him more in the leadership role. Achara. And that will draw the whistle on Natty Clark. Headed up by Bartlett. Brains. Shayway. High lofting ball. Goes over to Seagal. Oh, 
whips it in, slapped aside, and now cleared away. Gabriel Segal down from the first team, traded from New York City FC. Comes over, does have one goal with the first team already this season, and that came. Sela to his left, drops it off for Segal, and wide. He had a wide open net. Really, this team still building out that roster, trying to get acclimated to one another. Really positive on the way they played so far. We're gonna have our first yellow card handed out. It's gonna go to Beto Avila. Javi Bula, he had a great chance earlier, but hit off the post. Otherwise, this game could very much be two to nil. And Omar Gray is gonna be called for a foul with that left arm pushing off. And Gray handed to yellow. Sargent, this pass intercepted by Gumbale. Cruz as Gumbale is upended. Swollen. Hadigan. Numbers inside. Hadigan. Blast it with the left just wide. He won that top right corner. Little wiggle room. Silla, out wide, Achara. Silla still maintain possession. Achara, stopped by Sheaway and then cleared off the back line by Pierre. Waits for some help. Avila in the channel. Works his way towards the area. The shot fired and one hops into the arms of Valdez. Earlier today, Toronto getting its first win of the season over FC Cincinnati. Yesterday saw Crown Legacy play a man down where he will tie the game up late and then get the win in the shootout over Huntsville. As we have another card handed out. This will go to Daimo Dos. If it is to Gray, this will be his second yellow card. So now Omar Gray's day is over. This is also a foul that he doesn't need to commit. He's got numbers back. He'll be swollen to whip it in. Near post, tipped on. Oh, just wide right there by Cruz. And that will close out the opening half of play. Sporting KC with a solid first half. Dynamo Dose, they were in, and then they lost. He was 22 years old out of Half Moon Bay, California. Meanwhile, Pal Vidal, last year's leader in goals for Sporting KC, will come onto the field. Lose possession. And now Vidal getting his first touch. Vidal slots it over. The shot roofed and up and over. Fashion Cruz with another great chance. Here's Cruz. Cruz, a couple of great chances here today, but unable to get a second goal for Sporting KC. Flores. Flores with the right. And now, coming onto the field for Dynamo Dos is Ify Udano, and Udano will come in for Isaiah Reed. Char now playing back further due to the absence of Omar Gray. Clark, Kumbale, the goal scorer, cuts it across. Vidal with the right, loses his balance. There's two players so far this season for Dynamo Dose have scored, Exxon Arzu as well as Steven Anner. Could chance we could see Anner at some point. Vidal. Failhomber also being inducted into the Sporting Legends for Sporting KC, their Hall of Fame. And became the 13th member inducted who have impacted this team. Flores playing out wide, looking for Cruz. 
opportunity. If he just taps that in, that should get by Valdez. Might be a learning moment there for Gumbale. Just take down the first opportunity. Six yards out, that's an easy tap in. Gumbale. Opportunity here for Sporting KC. It's Cruz once again. And this one knocked away by Valdez. Also entering will be Maddox Finley. Habibula at the top of the 18. Pierre repelled away. Getting back is Clark. Also over was Reigns. Habibula. Odessa on his backside. Service headed away. So Swan will now go off and Ethan Bryant will come on. So Ethan Bryant last year second on the team in scoring behind Pal Vidal. Both those players on the field now. Mbale cuts it across. Sporting KC appealing for a handball, not going to get it. MLS's team in match day eight. Here's maybe an opportunity for Sporting KC. The doll to his right, curling! Just on the edge of the area, scoop pass. Pushed away by Finley. Cruz. Flores. Habibula into Bryant. Bryant from the top of the area. And easily scooped by Valdez. Bryant now to play it in after subbing on for Jake Swallen. High arcing ball headed down off the post. Great look there from Rindov. Sent right back into the mixer. Sergeant able to get ahead to it. What a great opportunity here by Chris Rindov. Hits it off the post. Take look back, nice ball in here by Bryant. And then you see Rendov gets Bryant. Gumbale has Bryant in the middle. The doll off to left. Gumbale. Dono back. Pass aside and deflected by Awadesu. Play back to Vidal, drops it off for Habibula to his right, pauses, deflected, and that's gonna go in for the second goal of the game for Sporting KC. Well, Habibula, back to back weeks with the goal as this hits off the backside of Parker Jackson. You look at it. And now Gumbale is gonna head off the field. And Meiji Alexandre will come on. Maybe another chance here. Bryant to the right foot. Bryant, a little space. And this goes into the side of the webbing and through. I don't know how that one snuck through for Sebastian Cruz, but he gets on the score sheet. Just somehow was able to get this through for the third goal of the game. This is a sharp angle here for Cruz. He was looking for one earlier, finally gets his goal. Look how steep he is there, just goes top. Bryant looking for Alexandre, and he roofs it in. So goals within a minute apart from one another from Alexandre and Cruz. How about this ball in by Ethan Bryant? And now Sporting KC pouring it on. Great job right there, Alexandre. First touch 
And there is the whistle, and Sporting Kansas City improves to three and two on the season. Meanwhile, Dynamo Dose, they continue to slump here early in the year as they are now handed their fourth loss of the season.